Hi students, this is Alex here. U is given as x bar y. We have to show dou square u by dou x dou y equal to dou square u by dou y dou x. Let's take the first part. In that, we are going to take the left hand side. That is nothing but dou square u by dou x dou y. We are going to rewrite this as dou by dou x of dou u by dou y. When I combine this, we get dou square u and denominator dou x dou y. So first we have to find the partial derivative with respect to y. That result we have to do partial derivative with respect to x. So first this one and second with respect to x. This is the order we proceed. Now u is given as x power y. So outside dou by dou x we are written as it is. Then dou by dou y of u is nothing but x power y. Here we are going to do with respect to y. So x is a constant. We have a basic formula in differentiation. Differentiation of a power x is a power x log a. So in the same way this x is a constant now. So we have constant power y. So its derivative before that we have to write the other terms as it is then dou by dou y of this term it is nothing but a power x but instead of a we have x. So it is constant power variable log of constant. Now this entire term we are going to do partial derivative with respect to x. So we are going to follow the product rule in that first term as it is and differentiation of log x is 1 by x plus second term as it is. Now differentiation of x power y, now y is a constant. So we have a basic formula x power n is nothing but n x power n minus 1. So here the power y is like n. So n x power n minus 1. So now we can rewrite this first term. This is power 1. When I take to the numerator, it will become minus 1. When I combine with this x power y, we will get x power y minus 1. Then these terms return as it is. Now it is easy to take x power y minus 1 common. So 1 plus log of x and this y is a product, we have to write it here. So this is a separate term, y is separate and this is separate. So it has to be written as y log x. So we have completed the left hand side. Now let's take the right hand side. So we will write this as 1 and we will take the right hand side which is nothing but dou square u by, this is the denominator it's dou y dou x. So let's write dou y dou x. So we have to rewrite this as dou by dou y dou u by dou x. Here the first part we are going to do with respect to x. Before that we will copy the u. So dou by dou y dou by dou x of x power y. Since we are going to do partial derivative with respect to x, y is a constant. When y is a constant, we apply x power n differentiation formula n x power n minus 1. And this y is like n. So outside terms, we have to write as it is dou by dou y into then its differentiation is y x power y minus 1. Now this entire term we have to do differentiation with respect to y. So x is treated as a constant. Once again let's follow uv method. So first term we have to write as it is. Now x is a constant. Already we have a formula that is a power x derivative is a power x log 
a now this is like a and this power is like x applying this formula its derivative is a power x so x power y minus 1 log x then second term written as it is derivative of the first term is 1 once again it is possible to take x power y minus 1 common so here we get y log x then plus 1 let's take this as 2 we see both are same so in the 1 also we have outside x power y minus 1 here also we have x power y minus 1 then we have 1 plus y log x here also 1 plus y log x so both are same so we can say from 1 and 2 we prove dou square u by in the first one we have dou x dou y dou x dou y which is equal to dou square u by dou y dou x so first part we prove this is nothing but u x y equal to u y x so we prove this now coming to the second part we have to prove this expression we already have x y and y x and in the starting it is differentiated with respect to x so since already we proved this expression we are going to differentiate this with respect to x so differentiating with respect to x it is a partial differentiation with respect to x that gives u x x y equal to u x y x so we prove the second part also 